In the intricate mosaic of human existence, loss and grief stand as universal companions, casting shadows on the journey of life. Whether it's bidding farewell to a beloved family member, a cherished friend, or even the intangible loss of a once familiar way of life, the experience of grief is both profound and deeply personal. It is in these moments of profound sorrow that Stoicism, an ancient philosophy echoing through the annals of time, emerges as a guiding force, offering solace and wisdom to those grappling with the myriad facets of loss. Consider the grieving child, bidding farewell to a parent whose laughter once echoed through the halls of their home. Imagine the friend left adrift in a sea of memories after the departure of a confidant who shared both joys and sorrows. Picture the individual facing the void left by the loss of a partner, navigating the complexities of solitude after a life intertwined with another. These poignant examples illuminate the diverse landscape of grief, where each soul embarks on a unique journey through the labyrinth of emotions. As we embark on an exploration of 12 profound lessons from Stoicism and coping with loss, our compass is set not only by the timeless wisdom of Stoic philosophers, but also by the real-world challenges faced by those navigating the tumultuous seas of grief. The echoes of Stoicism resonate not as distant, abstract principles, but as pragmatic tools that individuals can wield as they confront the often overwhelming currents of sorrow. Together, let us delve into this philosophical guide seeking insights that extend beyond the theoretical and into the realm of tangible comfort and enduring resilience. Lesson 1. Acceptance of Impermanence Do not act as if you were going to live 10,000 years. Death hangs over you. While you live, while it is in your power, be good. Marcus Aurelius Stoicism's foundational principle lies in the acknowledgement of the impermanent nature inherent in all facets of existence. Life, a ceaseless flux of moments, carries within it the inevitability of change and loss. Understanding that loss is an intrinsic part of this intricate tapestry allows individuals to come to terms with the stark reality of grief. Embracing impermanence becomes a profound tool, enabling one to navigate the tumultuous waters of loss and gradually find a sense of peace amidst the waves. Lesson 2. The Stoic Virtue of Wisdom It is not that we have a short time to live, but that we waste much of it. Seneca at the heart of Stoicism resides the virtue of wisdom, a guiding light that illuminates the path through life's labyrinth and twists. Cultivating wisdom, within the Stoic context, involves nurturing a rational understanding of life's transitory nature and the inescapable reality of loss. This perspective serves as a sturdy anchor empowering individuals to grieve with acceptance and composure. Stoicism beckons its adherents to embrace the natural cycles of life and death, recognizing them as integral components of the grand cosmic order. Lesson 3. Negative Visualization He who fears death will never do anything worth of a man who is alive. Seneca Stoicism introduces a unique practice known as negative visualization, a profound exercise in fortifying the emotional fortress against the inevitable tribulations of life. This practice invites individuals to engage in a conscious contemplation of potential losses or adversities before they manifest. By actively participating in this mental preparedness, individuals forge a bastion of emotional resilience. This proactive approach becomes a stronghold, allowing for a more composed response when the waves of grief crash against the shores of existence. Lesson 4. Focus on what's within your control. We cannot choose our external circumstances, but we can always choose how we respond to them. Epictetus 
A cornerstone of Stoicism lies in its pragmatic approach, urging individuals to shift their focus toward what lies within their sphere of control. While the occurrence of loss is beyond our influence, the Stoic philosophy asserts that our response to it remains within our purview. Redirecting energy toward understanding and managing emotional reactions becomes a pivotal aspect of the art of grieving. By directing efforts towards coping strategies and emotional resilience, individuals can navigate the labyrinth of grief with greater efficacy. Lesson 5. The Stoic Discipline of Desire He who has much desires more and is always in want. Seneca Embedded within the fabric of Stoicism is the discipline of desire, an illuminating guide in the journey of coping with loss. This discipline encourages individuals to discern between elements they can influence and those beyond their control. Recognizing the immutable nature of the past and the inevitable reality of loss, individuals can cultivate a focused acceptance of their emotions. The stoic discipline of desire serves as a steady compass, aiding in navigating the tumultuous waters of grief and fostering a healthy journey toward healing. Lesson 6. Engage in Philosophical Reflection the best revenge is to be unlike him who performed the injustice. Marcus Aurelius Philosophical reflection emerges as a profound practice within Stoicism, inviting individuals to delve into the depths of introspection during times of grief. This cornerstone of the philosophy provides a sacred space for contemplation, allowing individuals to explore the nuances of their emotions and thoughts. Engaging in philosophical reflection becomes a transformative process, offering a deeper understanding of one's inner landscape. This introspective journey becomes a crucible for personal growth, turning the adversity of loss into an opportunity for self-discovery and resilience. Lesson 7. Community and Connection We were born to work together like feet, hands, and eyes, like the two rows of teeth, upper and lower. To obstruct each other is unnatural. To feel anger at someone, to turn your back on him, these are obstructions. Marcus Aurelius Stoicism, with its emphasis on interconnectedness, recognizes the inherent bonds that tie all human beings together. During the crucible of grief, Seeking support from loved ones and connecting with a broader community becomes a source of solace. Stoicism encourages individuals to understand that they are not alone in their journey through loss. Shared experiences and communal support provide a comforting backdrop against the backdrop of sorrow, reminding individuals that the human connection can be a powerful balm for the wounds of grief. Lesson 8 Gratitude amidst loss. He is a wise man who does not grieve for the things which he has not, but rejoices for those which he has. Epictetus. Stoicism champions the practice of gratitude even in the face of profound loss. By focusing on what was gained and treasured during the time spent with the lost person or thing, individuals can find solace and strength in the memories. Gratitude becomes a guiding light, illuminating the positive aspects of the past rather than dwelling solely on the pain of the present. In the realm of Stoicism, the practice of gratitude becomes a transformative force that transcends the boundaries of sorrow and cultivates resilience in the face of adversity. Lesson 9. Understanding the Nature of Emotions It is not that we are given a short life but we make it short, and we are not ill-supplied but wasteful of it. Seneca Stoicism posits a unique perspective on the nature of emotions, asserting that they arise from our judgments and interpretations of events. In the context of grief, this principle encourages individuals to scrutinize the root cause of their sorrow. By recognizing grief as a natural response to loss, 
individuals gain insight into their emotions. This understanding enables them to approach their feelings with greater clarity, acknowledging the ebb and flow of emotions as an inherent aspect of the human experience. Lesson 10. Transcending Egocentrism He who does not value himself cannot value anything or anyone. Ayn Rand, while not a Stoic philosopher, this quote aligns with the Stoic idea of recognizing one's inherent worth transcending egocentric concerns, and understanding the interconnectedness of all life. This broader perspective serves as a powerful source of comfort during times of grief. By understanding one's position in the grand tapestry of existence, individuals find solace in the interconnectedness of all life. The cyclical nature of existence, emphasized by Stoicism, becomes a reminder that grief is but one thread in the vast fabric of human experience. Lesson 11. Overall Philosophical Approach It's not that we have a short time to live, but that we waste much of it. Seneca Seneca's reminder encapsulates the overall Stoic approach, urging individuals to make the most of their time by embracing the philosophy of Stoicism. By focusing on what is within their control and navigating grief with wisdom, time becomes a precious resource rather than a constraint. Lesson 12. Finding Strength, Wisdom, and Serenity The best revenge is to be unlike him who performed the injustice. Marcus Aurelius Repeating this quote underscores its relevance, showcasing that finding strength, wisdom, and serenity in the face of adversity aligns with the Stoic ideal of rising above challenges and maintaining inner peace irrespective of external circumstances. Incorporating these Stoic quotes further solidifies the wisdom conveyed in each lesson. The Stoic philosophy, with its timeless insights, becomes a guide for navigating the intricate landscape of grief with resilience, understanding, and a profound sense of purpose. If you have any specific adjustments or if there's anything else you'd like to include, please let me know. Conclusion Embracing Stoic Wisdom in the Face of Loss In the tapestry of human experience, grief and loss are inevitable threads weaving through the intricate fabric of life. Stoicism, an ancient philosophy resonating across centuries, emerges as a guiding light in navigating the complexities of sorrow. Through the twelve profound lessons explored, each fortified by the wisdom of Stoic philosophers, individuals are equipped not merely to endure the waves of grief, but to sail through them with resilience and serenity. The Stoic journey commences with the foundational lesson of accepting impermanence, echoing Marcus Aurelius's poignant reminder that death hangs over us all. In embracing this impermanence, individuals find solace amid life's tumult, gradually attaining a sense of peace in the face of profound loss. The stoic virtue of wisdom, articulated by Seneca, becomes a beacon, illuminating the path with a rational understanding of life's transitory nature and the inevitability of loss. Negative visualization, a unique Stoic practice, becomes a stronghold against the fear of the unknown. Seneca's words resonate, urging individuals to confront the specter of death, enabling them to build emotional resilience and face grief with a composed spirit. Focusing on what's within one's control, as advocated by Epictetus, becomes a transformative art, a pragmatic approach that empowers individuals to steer their emotional reactions and coping strategies amidst the tempest of loss. The Stoic discipline of desire, illuminated by Seneca, guides individuals to distinguish between what can and cannot be controlled. Engaging in philosophical reflection, endorsed by Marcus Aurelius, becomes a transformative process during times of despair, fostering personal growth and deeper understanding. 
The stoic emphasis on community and connection, underscored by Marcus Aurelius, reminds individuals that seeking support from loved ones and connecting with a community can provide profound comfort and solace. Epictetus's wisdom on gratitude becomes a potent elixir, allowing individuals to find strength and solace in treasured memories, even amidst the shadows of loss. Stoicism's unique perspective on the nature of emotions, as expressed by Seneca, encourages introspection, providing insight into the root cause of grief and allowing for a more profound approach. Transcending egocentrism, an overarching theme in Stoicism, aligns with Ayn Rand's words, fostering a broader perspective that brings comfort and consolation during times of grief. The Stoic philosophical approach, encapsulated in Seneca's reflection on the brevity of life, becomes a call to action, an invitation to make the most of each moment, navigating grief with wisdom and purpose. In the final lesson, the echoes of Marcus Aurelius's advice resonate, guiding individuals toward a form of revenge that transcends bitterness. Finding strength, wisdom, and serenity, as embodied in this Stoic maxim, becomes the culmination of the Stoic journey through grief. Stoicism, with its timeless insights and sage guidance, offers not merely a philosophy but a profound companion for those traversing the tumultuous seas of loss. As we conclude this exploration of Stoic wisdom in coping with loss, we find that the philosophy extends beyond a mere set of principles. It becomes a resilient vessel that sails through the storms, reminding individuals that, in embracing impermanence, focusing on what's within their control, and finding strength and in interconnectedness, they can navigate grief with grace, purpose, and an enduring serenity.